Alright, so I gotta keep, like, breaking my videos up for some reason. I don't know how many y'all done got by now, but I'm switching in between phones. And, um, so I'm about to just finish off where I left off with Chubby and saying, like, how he, um, was cleaning up and shit behind her. So I gotta go to the second portion of him in the, um, dishwashing room again, because he came through twice. Alright, hold on. Alright, so this is going to be him coming in the first time. Like, I just wanted to show it again. And on this one, I'm going to show the time. Now, why would he be down here in the kitchen? That's the first question. Red flag. He down there with somebody. That says a lot. That this kitchen was never empty. And then, we don't even know what time it is. It could be around the same time he, um... Brought the uh cleaning thing from out of that closet when he just changed the solution or whatever he did in that little back room over there that I showed y'all previously that was like to the dock area, access to the dock area. But I'm going to show y'all the time real quick because it's like right still there. Hold on. All right, so this is just the time video to the video or whatever. Like there ain't no time up in the video. So that's the time right there. Now watch this. You're going to see him again, yeah. All right, I just wanted to show y'all him. All right, so he leaving right now. It's 528 or whatever. So he leaving now. Watch this. I'm going to show y'all him again. He's going to come right back to this bitch. And I know y'all probably saying, like, okay, well, just get to the point. I am, though. Like, this video is going to be a little long. I'm sorry. I ain't never really had no long videos. Like, But it's like every time I'm trying to get to my points, the video keep cutting off because my phone's shitty. I need to upgrade a little bit, but I'm just, like, saying fuck it because they going to hack that phone, too. But, um, I'm going to just show y'all him the second time around. But the reason why I'm just, like, dragging along is because I want to, like, come with that shit. Like, I want to paint the picture for y'all that these motherfuckers was doing everything that shows a, cr a crime being committed. We just not looking at the right stuff. Like, and I want to kind of put it together, like, because it's all in this video for sure. Like, we might not see the actual action, but you can use that logic and expectation that they wanted us to run with when it came to her. So, I want to use the same expectations and flip it on them. So, if you cleaning, why are you in the kitchen cleaning if you're the housekeeper? Red flag. Alright, so I just paused the video because I wanted to, like, move towards the part. But why y'all doing all that if there ain't nothing going on? You know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm just kind of using my logic and looking at this shit for what it is. And I'm hoping that, like, I can paint this picture for everybody else that's been lost and all that stuff. Now, the reason why I'm saying, like, I'm concluding, like, the reason why I'm saying that I know that they did something because I'm concluding that when they did all this extra shit that they are doing, it's like just when you watch them uh, mafia movies and shit and all that shit and you see, like, or, like, any Texas Chainsaw Massacre. There's just shit that you gotta do. There's processes. Like, you gotta clean the shit up. You gotta do the shit. You gotta hack the people up. You got the cutting boards. That's for them doing that. You saw that. You got the knives. You saw that. Like, I've been showing all of this stuff. But I'm trying to put it in one video this time. That's why it's taking so long. And then you got um, people just hiding all their transports. Which I believe is bodies. Of all the victims. And uh, justice for all them victims. And then it's like. All the motherfuckers hid this shit in plain sight. Because these motherfuckers is all foreigners. So therefore there was no way we can catch up with them. But I caught up with some of them. And they don't. They know not to let me show my photos. Because I feel like if I showed like who I got in comparison. With the people I found in real life. They'll probably really try to find my motherfucking ass. But um. So, I'm about to unpause it and get back to his second part because I don't keep wanting to ramble on. But I feel like they did everything that they supposed to do to commit a crime. Now, let's go. Alright, then you're going to see your mop guy. You seen him? See the cohesion? You see him? Now, he back. Hold on, let me pause it again so I can show you the time. 624, right? That's different. Oh, there he is once again. Why does he keep coming in this kitchen? And you notice he got the little shop back and shit. So that shit can work on any floors. He used that motherfucker all night. All night. So y'all see it here first. This motherfucker been cleaning the whole night. He went from 
floor to floor. He went from every floor that she was in to all the other victims. That's how I know that this kitchen was very important. That's why I started here first. And why didn't we see her go through this kitchen? Because I just showed you in the previous video that the guy with the um ice that came from out of the lower level kitchen with the ice. And he had like a little like trash can and it was white. And it had the uh sheets covered over it. And it looked like somebody's head was peeking up. That dude gave it away once again. Like I just keep finding more and more. I had the dude with the... um. The cup that had the red shirt on, who also had the brick, he was in here pouring that uh, liquid. That one gave it away. And then once I seen Teresa come through here, that really gave it away. That tied the shit in. And if y'all want to hear more about uh, Teresa, shout out to Malika. She been tearing Teresa's ass up. Man, shh, I, I, that's all I need to say. Shout out to Malika. Go, go to, uh, subscribe over there. Malika's World. Um... She got Malika the Lioness, and she got uh, Ladies at the Round Table. She be doing her thing, and she's very spiritual, and she know what she's talking about, because I've been feeling the same way about this whole fucking situation. But let's go. We ain't finished talking about these dirty motherfuckers, and they trying to cover this shit up. So I don't know if they just playing with us, and they just making it look like he leaving again, but damn, them times is pretty close. Hold so he leaving now. I don't know if they're just playing with us and they doing that real editing down here too. But I'm about to pause it so I can get the time. I'm going to go back. Uh, he leaving. I know this is all small talk to y'all, but I know I'm trying to just paint this picture because they don't got no time up here. Just so everybody else can see it. All right, so next thing. Okay, before I move on to what I was going to go to next, here go my butcher. This is who I think cut her up because I got him holding a knife in the other room when he grabbed that board at like six something. I know that's him for sure. I'm almost 100, I'm 1000 percent sure that was him. But all right, next to my ice, this is where the preservation begins. And this is why I say she was placed in that fucking kitchen. All right, so now we in there and everything. And then y'all notice, this ain't lower level kitchen, right? But they try to make this seem like this is upstairs and shit. All right, now I want to zoom in a little bit. Y'all can see the time already. All right, y'all remember this? I don't know if y'all do, but um, many of us that was like in this case in the beginning, I remember uh, Straight Drop. He dropped a video about them carrying a girl. Like, see, they got a butcher right there. Hold on. But he showed a girl, uh, like, being carried over there. Now, I noticed that they fixed that for some reason. And I'm going to show y'all that video, too, as a little extra bonus. But the dude that set the ice machine, that was not the beverage manager. That was the only thing that he had wrong in my eyes. Well, I don't really know about the choking situation because I couldn't tell. But about the carrying part, he definitely caught that. Because why ain't it in this video no more? And I'm going to just show this whole little skit. Because I think it go to like 528 or something like that. Now you seen that glitch? That wasn't me. It was like with that. Like it was supposed to be black or some shit. Like a black dude. And it's also another suspect of mine. I call him, um, I forgot. But he another like tall ass, limpy, gimpy looking motherfucker. Now this is the same guy that I caught walking out of the um out of this room and went through the dishwasher. There he go. There go my other suspect. There he go. Bow legged Lou. There he go. That's the one I think that was carrying her. And watch when I show y'all this next video. Y'all gonna see what I'm talking about. So it's like the dude right there is gonna be the one that went into the uh dishwashing room. And he pushed it through, and this is why I knew. That this was not where they said it was. That dishwashing room, rather. It wasn't where they said it was. See? He's taking it to the dishwashing room right now. We in the lower level, though. See that lower level kitchen? Now, you ain't see nothing, right? Watch this. Alright. Now, it's a little fuzzy because at the time, he didn't really have a good phone. I really wasn't watching you uh, straight drop at this time. I really don't now, but... I just wanted to show y'all that, that this is now missing. And this is the same exact scene, but it looks completely different. And then, you see it? I'll pause it and go back for y'all. And then also look at the camera panning. 
That ain't the camera on the wall. Because you can tell. Because it's like a frontal view. But hold on. Let me show y'all something. I'm going to let y'all see it one more time. Hopefully they show it again. That's the dude boat. Like a little I was just talking about right there. Here it comes. I believe it's going to show it again. If not, I'm going to go back. I know, I know this is going to be like, what the fuck is that? But, like, I'm trying to point out to you exactly where each person is. Because it's like somebody has her being carried through the thing. So this is the person that I said was bolt-legged Lou. And then this is who I think she is. And they're, like, taking her through the doorway. But it, like, glitches kind of. like, And then the person holding the camera that was there witnessing this shit was moving and shit. And that's how you know this wasn't no camera on the wall. And then I'm going to show y'all something else. So I'm going to play it back a little bit so y'all can see it in, in emotion again. And then I'm going to talk about the dude that was on the other video where they took it out, took this out. And I'm going to say that he was also a person that I recognized too. One second. I'm just trying to go right back to that spot to where y'all can see I'm going to try to hold it as steady as... You see it? You see it? Wow, that's crazy, ain't it? Looks like they got their hand in the cookie jar, don't it? Now, let's go back to the original video that I just was watching. We ain't going to see none of that. He's still at the ice machine. So, just pay attention. And you see, he comes out. Watch this. Okay, this is what I wanted to point out. This guy right here? Remember the guy that uh, gave the signal for the body dragon? That's him right there. They're walking up there. I know these people's walks. <laughs> I know they hate me. I know they do. Observant than a motherfucker. That's him. And you ain't never gonna see what you just saw in the video with them carrying her through. Because they took it out. And it was late in the game. And they knew that we was catching on. So they removed it. Because you're supposed to see it as the other dude that was in all black comes out from the uh, room. So it should have happened before that. But you notice also, you never seen the dude in a white shirt either. Now he getting his ice, right? Now he's supposed to be the only one there when it occurs. So glitch, this is when it happens. That's what I believe. And they fixed it. And they put him in here somehow to block it up. And then they gonna put somebody else there. Get the fuck out of here. And make it seem like that was him this whole time. Because you see he got something he carrying now. Yeah, right. And then you're going to see black, the dude in black. Watch. Watch. I'm going to try to like focus on the time. Sorry. But I don't want you to not see. See? So that should have happened. That was the same motion. You'll be able to see it once you break it down yourself. But this shit, man, this is the preparation. And there's the table for the preparation. Alright, so here you go. So this is the guy that was at the end of that thing. Get this face for y'all. If y'all can't see him, hold on one second. I'll get a good picture of him. One second. I go back to the other room. Oh, okay. So here you go. When he came in to go to the dishwashing room. Take it through the dishwasher room. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to go and get sidetracked. I'm hoping I ain't all over the place. I probably am. But let's go to the boat like a loop. I'm sorry. He distorted. I just seen some shit live while I'm trying to record. I don't know what the fuck that is. I guess it's soup. Mm -hmm. Like he was in the footage. It's just that he's standing up here. And that's why I was looking at this. But... I'm trying to wait till he comes up this way so y'all can get his face. Hold on. All right, here he goes. Sorry. Now y'all get to get his face. Nah, I rock. Bam! And that's the butcher right there. Mm hmm. Yeah. Acting like he making some sandwiches and shit. Okay. Sure. Why ain't he um, cutting up none of the meat? With the uh, thing that they got in the uh, grocery stores in the deli. Why ain't he cutting up his meat or nothing? And why is everything being done off camera? Yeah. So this is what they all been doing. 
I'm gonna just show y'all, and I'm wrapping this video up with this last comment. And he got coffee. Mm. Wow. That's why I know that this ain't the kitchen that they claim it is. And you peep where the time go and where the marker go about what kitchen this is. You see how every time I'm thinking like, oh, it's all over and I'm not going to see what I want to see. And bam, all the videos that I've shown you throughout all these videos. Every time I've went to another area, there's always something different in it. In the same area, though. Like, it'll be, I'll go to the lower level kitchen like this, and then I'll go back to it, and then there'll be one video that don't have no time. But why? Hmm. So this is what they've been doing. Oh, he can't take a sip. I couldn't miss this. Hold up. Mmm. Our coffee cup, it belonged to somebody. And I got another person, which is him right here. He got coffee, y'all. That's my first coffee cup, man. That's who I think coffee cup it is. And he was with uh Bo Legged Lou damn near the whole night. I watched him too. I got a lot of suspects because there's so many people in here. But you notice, I never pointed out that older man. I know who I want. I ain't point him out. But I know who I want. That's what they doing. Alright, thank you so much for everyone uh, watching. And I know it was a bit long, but thank you for sticking in there with me. I hope I gave everyone a clear understanding of how I feel about this case as well as painting the picture for everyone. Um, it took a very, whew, this took a long time. That's what took me so long to get this breakdown together. But I'm hoping that we can continue on this journey because I'm not stopping until she get justice, until Kanika get justice. She has been the main thing, like, to where you know that once we get justice for her, it'll open all the doors for all the rest of these victims of human trafficking, sex trafficking, all these satanic rituals, human trafficking, organ trafficking, all that and everything else. But you know what? We out. Should we rob the bank? somebody if you good. Funny on medicine. No more funny looking underwear if you look good for Can you live with the terms that your dons have set forth? Yes, Monifa, Shamaya, Bree Bree, Irene. Y'all pick y'all character. And we out.